we're very passionate about what we do. You know, we're very passionate about the opportunities that we create for employees. And it's hard to see those employees have to go find other work. It's hard to walk up to a man and tell him that, you know, that his services are no longer needed here because, because the government has overreached and has uh, put them out of a job. We've been doing this in our family for four generations. We've had a lot of good employees behind us for years and years. We've got a good operation. We've got an efficient operation. And it's hard, it's hard when that isn't enough. You know, work hard and watch your employees take pay cuts, working more for less. You know, it's hard to, you know, to see that when it doesn't have to be that way. Uh, you know, when the opportunities are still here, uh, the coal's still here, the jobs are still here. It's a shame that the government has choked and bottleneck the industry like it has. You shouldn't always have to ask for assistance. You need somebody in the office, they're there. They're gonna help you out. It don't even have to be requested. If we were gonna get some kind of political relief on a mining industry, would it have not already been there with the same guy in the office for years? I mean, what, shouldn't the record kind of speak for itself? Uh, and that's what we've needed all along. We need, we need you in office, and I know because you've been directly and personally involved in the coal industry for years now, and your assistance has always been there. Your support's always been there. And we felt that, we always have felt that. When you start politically speaking about what you can do for us now, that's what gets me so excited as a mine operator, is just basically be able to look at these guys that work for us and, and know that their efforts are gonna pay off. Help is on the way. But I'm gonna go to Frankfurt and take the common sense approach to make sure coal miners keep their job, make sure EPA backs off of their regulations so industry and coal mines and farmers and everybody else in this commonwealth can run their business successfully and do what they're good at. You know, so many times we have government officials telling our businesses how to do something, they've never done it a day in their life. Let business owners do what they're best at.